Hello everyone, welcome to our new video. In this video, we'll show you how to create catalogs for your Shopify store. Okay, so this would be a complete process and I'll show you how we can do it easily. Okay, so without any further delay, let's get started. So you can see over here, I have created a demo Shopify store and I have uploaded of six products over here and we're going to be creating catalogs using these six products okay so i have come to the business manager then i'm going to navigate to the data source section and i'm going to click on data sets okay uh, uh not data sets actually i'm going to go to the catalog section sorry my bad so i'm gonna click on add then i'll click on create new catalogs and i'm gonna click on continue so it is navigating to the commerce manager section then as the product category uh i'll be choosing online products okay so if you have different categories then you can choose any of them okay but for the time being i'll be choosing online products and i'm gonna enable this uh radio button okay connect to a partner platform and i'll be choosing shopify from here okay so if you have different platforms then you can choose from this section okay but for the time being we are going to be choosing shopify and it will be showing your business manager name okay which is called business portfolio nowadays. And then you need to provide your Shopify domain. Okay, so I'm gonna go to here and I'm gonna copy the domain from here. This is this one. Then I'm gonna enter it over here and I'll click on continue on Shopify. Then it will be redirecting me to my Shopify admin panel. Okay, just wait a little bit. <clears throat> then you can see over here uh this is an app called facebook and instagram so you have to install this app so i have already installed it uh from this section so if you go to online store uh and if you search for <clears throat> facebook and instagram then uh you will be able to uh install this app okay so I have already installed it. That's why it is appearing over here. Then I'll click on get started. Then I need to connect my Facebook account. Okay, so I'm gonna connect the account. So it will be redirected to my Facebook page. So it is showing continue as Ridoy. So I'm gonna click on it. Then it will be connecting my uh facebook account it has already been connected now i need to choose the business portfolio or business manager account so i'm gonna choose my account from here which is this one then i'm gonna choose enhanced and click on save then i need to choose the data set so i'll be choosing this data set okay i'm gonna click on connect and i'll Enable this checkbox and I'm going to click on submit for review. Okay. Then you can see over here finalizing channel setup. It is uploading the products. Okay. Just wait a little bit and don't refresh the skin while it is uploading. Okay. So we need to wait for a little bit. Okay. Perfect. So you can see over here approved six products okay so let's go to the catalog uh, and refresh the screen so you can see over here shopify product catalog uh, has been created Okay, so I'm going to select this one and I'll click on open in commerce manager.
then you will see the approved items okay so you can see six items has been approved okay perfect so currently i have only six products that's why our uh, six items has been showing over there okay so if you have so many products then you can do it uh, easily by connecting your shopify store with catalog okay perfect now if you want to create uh, sets uh, for different products then you can do it from here so i'll show you how you can easily create sets okay so i'm gonna click on create set use filters and set name would be okay so let's go to the website and silver okay so let's create a set for those products uh, whose name is start with quicksilver okay so i'm gonna copy this name okay so i'll write it manually mm, i'll write it uh product products title contains quicksilver quicksilver okay then from the attribute section i'm gonna choose title and condition would be contains and i'm gonna give the value as quicksilver so i'll write quick silver okay so this one and i'm gonna click on create so you can see over here your set is being created okay you can see over here in this product set uh we have three items product title contains quicksilver so these three item uh, titles uh, contains quicksilvers that's why it is uh, uh, that's why they are appearing over here okay so this is how you can create multiple sets if you have um multiple uh if you want to create multiple sets and if you have so many products and you want to uh, create sets for best selling products or uh the name with the product okay so yeah this is how you can create different types of sets and you can use the th them in your ads like different sets you can target you can create different ad sets and you can target different product sets in e set sets okay so yeah so this is how you can uh, set up catalogs for your shopify store and if you want you can create multiple sets then okay so yeah that's it for this video hopefully you have liked our video if you like our video then you can subscribe our channel follow our page yeah, have a good day bye bye